hello youtube this is a quick update video about i updated my os x yosemite to the latest developer beta edition os x el capitan yes it is el capitan uh, 10.11 uh, my macbook pro i brought in uh, 2015 march it is uh, late uh, sorry it's not late it is mid 2014 uh, macbook pro with uh, gt 750m graphics card and what i noticed is uh, it's a uh, little bit faster than uh, os x yosemite and it is uh, using much less memory when uh, memory is not required uh, Yosemite by default uh, use around 9 GB, 14 GB, sometimes 15 GB when I use a uh, single application like Safari or Sublime Text uh, something like a little bit small uh, task uh, it's a using much memory I contacted Apple support and asked about it and they told me you don't need to care about these things you just do your work uh, operating system will take care of everything and there is no lag in Yosemite it's working fine perfectly fine so I don't have any problem but in uh, this new update I found that uh, it's using much less memory and there is some uh, minor improvements in multitasking uh, multi desktop features uh, now you can add as many as desktops you want I think previously it was five i think so i am new to mac so i don't know i think it was five now you can add as many as in each screen uh, if you have an external monitor you can add more monitors on this mo that monitor it's all <coughs> that monitor also okay uh, it's handling all my tasks very well uh, there is no problem uh, while using multiple apps uh, there is no lag or uh, something like that yes you can see I run a lot of virtual machines at same time uh, testing my applications uh, it's uh, open to Linux I'm developing for this website openspeedtest.com they are using HTML5 for testing your internet speed I'm developing this application this new beta uh, if you need uh, you can check that out openspeedtest.com slash beta 2 okay forward slash beta 2 and uh, as you can see uh, all operating systems are uh, running at the same time uh, since uh, it's, uh, there is no lag or something like that this is windows 10 mm, this is windows 8.1 and this is android 4.0 for testing purpose mm, <coughs> and uh, Safari, Opera, and Firefox Developer Edition. Uh, I'll show you the Windows Snap Pitch feature. Uh, if you need to snap a window to side, like a window, uh, in Windows 7, you can do the same. Windows 8, you can do the same. Uh, you click and hold this green button, it will do that, and you can get a split screen view like this. Uh, you can adjust it. Uh, also uh, when you swipe up with uh, your three fingers it will show uh, individual application names like parallels desktop uh, desktop one three five and you uh, move your mouse uh, to top uh, it will show the desktop and the applications uh, preview uh, this is uh, windows 8.1 and this is windows 10 I don't know something yeah it's working okay Windows 10 oh it's browser Spartan it's Spartan still Spartan I downloaded extra day the new update but still it is showing that Spartan uh, I think uh, they renamed to Microsoft Edge uh, but still it's showing Spartan I don't know uh, it's working fine um, Windows 10 will be huge for Microsoft and they are doing a good job I will I like this operating system because uh, this is what uh, we need for a desktop uh, not this stuff uh, this is for touch uh, okay uh, this is Ubuntu uh, in Ubuntu Firefox works better than OS X or Windows 
I don't know why uh, when you click uh, debugger options uh, some uh, URLs will not uh, get uh, loaded on uh, URL contents uh, will not get loaded on uh, Firefox in OS X or Windows but in uh, Ubuntu it is working uh, fine it's uh, fast and smooth and the scrolling is uh, super smooth than OS X and and you get a new disk utility mm. also you can search uh, using natural languages in spotlight like uh, mail from sorry from ex sorry 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 xcdn yeah, yesterday I contacted XCDN support. Uh, yeah, uh, you can uh, search like that, made from uh, your friend or something like that. And <coughs> yeah, you got a new disk utility. Uh, this is 500 GB Apple PCI SSD hard disk. Uh, I partitioned it to two uh, 100 GB for OSX and 400 GB for 399. 0.8 400 GB for uh, my stuff media etc uh, I'm a Windows user for more than 10 years so I cannot trust uh, the OS drive I mean uh, the C drive in Windows so uh, in OS X also I partitioned my hard disk and uh, put OS X on uh, this drive and made another drive for my files also took a uh, image uh, of OSX drive and keep it my keep it on my uh, hard disk in case as uh, since it is not failed uh, it's working fine there is no problem there's no lags and I try some the application like CCleaner in Windows uh, we often used CCleaner for cleanup files uh, when I uh, used for this Mac for three months after that I opened CCleaner and do a scan and I found that there is only uh, internet uh, safari or sorry chrome internet, i use chrome a lot uh, internet uh, catches there is nothing mm, more than that uh, there is nothing to clean up OSX will automatically do it for you and uh, that's it uh, there is no much features but uh, under the hood the operating system is improved a lot uh, you can see the performance now it is using 15.4 GB 15.24 GB RAM uh, but still everything is fine smooth no problems you can multitask or you can run as many as virtual machines you can uh, there is no problem everything is smooth okay mm, the Windows snaps feature I don't think it's much useful but okay uh, in Windows uh, 8 or Windows 7 I used that feature a lot uh, also that uh, win window uh, maximizing feature uh, this thing I will show you oh, sorry missing shortcut okay okay that's also missing mm. okay yeah this one we can uh, maximize that there is an extension uh, for OS X to do the same but I never downloaded it because I like to use the default OS experience uh, I don't want to install any third-party application for the same feature but thankfully OS X uh, bring that feature to uh, OS X by with this update see you can snap and you can code yeah, debug and you can code debug and you can code okay <laughs> okay uh, in there is one more thing in uh, desktop one only you will get uh, uh, this kind of uh, you can drag and drop window to any other uh, desktops in desktop one I think in desktop two I think you cannot do that uh, let me try yeah it's working okay you can drag and drop application to any windows it's not going okay no it's not going 
Yo, you cannot do that. Okay, you cannot do that. Okay, a free text. Oh yeah, you can drop to free desktop. Uh, desktop with no other applications. Okay. Mm, Windows eight. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, that's it for now. Uh, it's a quick update video about OSX L Capitan. Mm, I think the final version will be better than this, but this is fine. There's no other problems. Uh, Spotlight uh, is using a lot of time to index your hard disk. Uh, it will uh, run uh, some task and find uh, and learn about your content your data uh, to process your natural language and find learn files anyway thanks for watching if you got time please go ahead and check my application openspeedtest.com slash beta 2 and you can comment here uh, you can test my application uh, it's will it will work on your iphone ipod or android or any uh, device uh, with a browser html5 compatible browser uh this is openspeedtest.com slash beta 2 okay anyway thanks for watching guys uh this is vishnu bye bye